Hey guys, what's Kraken Guzman here coming at you with another fight night. Uh, today we've got uh, some pretty hype matchup going on here. We've got Blasters, uh, aka MLB, not PBO, that's that's different, uh, versus Varga Dragress. And you might be questioning, oh, but this isn't really like a brand new matchup. We've, we've had these decks out for a minute. Why are you doing this? Simple. They both got really, really cool support cards. Uh, we got that Blazing Monk, uh, I don't even know the name of it. What's the name of your support card, David? Uh, that's a great question. It starts with an R. Uh, it's like, uh, Ray Ryu? I don't know. It's, 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 it starts with an R, man. <laughs> yeah, something like that. It's, 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 it's a cool one. It's, it does, it prevents the opponent from intercepting. It's just a really nice uh, card. Rokuse. 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 That's what it is. Uh, over yeah. on my side, we got yet another Blaster Blade because we didn't need to stop at 20 different versions, right? We got Blaster Blade Zahvangaro. Gives you more multi attack in the MLB deck, and it also gives you an 18k base, which is what I always thought MLB should be. So now you're at a 20k base because MLB just gets more MLB as we keep MLBing. <laughs> uh, now, let's get this going. I've already lost the die roll, so you get to choose how the battle will be won. I will go first. I would imagine so. I I think you would like a turn versus a 10k than a 20k. Indeed. Ooh. All right. This is a decent starting hand. All right. Ready Let's when you are. Let's do it. Stand up. Zah. Bungaro. Wing all brave. Uh, bitch mid hat. Meat hot. Provided pass. Okay. Draw. I'll discard Biscotti in order to ride to Marin. And also get ourselves energy generator. Biscotti can energy blast through to draw a card, and I draw a card off Wingo Brave. Attack for eight. OT. Check. Ooh, you were right to do that. I end my turn. Stand in turn. Pitch, critical trigger, ride, because soul charge one. Oh, okay. Mm, that's out. That, uh, that's not great. It is what it is. AK van. Hmm. No guard. Think of that. I think not. And that's a no pass, because I know what's in your soul. Yeah. Pass turn. Stand and draw. Alright. Discard. Ride Blasto Blade or the little sage of Marin will be activating her skill. I'll also energy charge three. Repeat the top seven cards of the deck. I'll add Blaster Blade to the hand. And then with Blaster Blade skill, Counter Blast one, your unit retreats. Sure. <laughs> You're so not. That's such a trifle, huh? <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, do I even want to deal you more damage, or do I just. Do I want to keep my units? I think I want to keep my cards. I'll swing for 10. No guard. Check. Ah, Drilling Angel. That was shook. Ah, it's a good thing I chose that. <laughs> Your uh, defensive would have denied me anyway. Done. Oh boy. <clears throat> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Something tells me you don't want to have your rear guards retired of my own volition. I also like to draw cards. <laughs> I do too. 15k van. Hmm. Defensive to make life easier? No. Tire and draw. 15k. Uh, can't chance it again. 
iron draw. Good. And swing. Kind of plus one. No guard. Okay. Alright, twin drive. First check. No trigger. Second check. Double the trigger. Ooh, guard, 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 guard. Damage check. Blaster blade. Last one. Get higher. Draw a card. Be stabbed. 33. Guard. Fester. Stand and draw. Oh my. Let's discard and ride Majesty Lord Blaster. Energy charge. Calling Emlyn. Activating skill. Soul Blast. Look at the top five cards of the deck. Come on, Blaster Dark. I need to see you now. Called Blaster Blade. Ruh row Raggy. Call Emlyn. Soul Blast 1. <laughs> see it this time? Call Blaster Dark. Ooh, we just breathed a sigh of relief, bro. Oh, that was close. Okay. Now. Calling Cell Gown. Ah, oh, best, best card in the nation. I, I'm here to remind you that I play Keter. <laughs> Go ahead. Move these positions. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I call over a blaster blade. And now we'll activate skill. I think I'm out of blaster blade, right? I am. Let's go ahead and throw it into the soul anyway. And shuffle because I know I'm going to whiff the top three regardless. But I have retired a rear guard this turn. Meaning I can get 5,000 power over to Blaster Dark. Okay. Blaster Dark is going to swing for 15. Emily gets 5,000 power whenever a blaster attacks. Alright. Majesty Lord Blaster will attack the Vanguard. Emily gets 5,000 power whenever a blaster attacks. Activating additional skill. I'll move Blaster Dark into the soul to gain a drive. Furthermore, MLB has a passive skill that you know all too well. As long as Blaster Blade and Darker in the Soul, 2,000 power and a critical are added at all times. 15 with a critical and drive. Doable. Hmm. No, I'll just PG it. Gotcha. First check. You were so right. Yep. Holy crap. That could have been over so quickly, my man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> okay. Boom, boom, boom. And then we'll take any card from a drop and add it back to the hand. I'll add back the Scotty. Draw off OT. Okay. Second check. No trigger. Third check. A critical trigger. All right. I'm going to give an additional critical to Emily. And power will go over to Cell Gown. Sure. And now. Stand up, the Avatar. Ride, last a blade or five thousand power to blaster blade. Swing with support. Cell Gown gets five thousand more power. They have more rear guards than you do. Emlyn technically gets more power, but who the frick cares? Uh, no guard. 
All right. Drive trigger check. No trigger. Damage check. Gun. Cell gallon skill activates. Look at the top two cards of the deck. One to the hand. One to the bottom of the deck. At the end of the battle, we go back into MLB. And now MLB gains another passive skill as long as we have the avatar in the soul, meaning that he's at an 18k base. In combination with this other skill, 20k base and a critical at all times, how fair? Hmm. Hmm. I think I'll... I think I'm gonna keep it at that for you. Should I? No, I think I can pressure even more. Counter blast. I'll do it again. Because I'm back at a grade 3 Vanguard. 5,000 power. Attack for 15. Let's guard with Galnet. And we'll put a grade 1 and the grade 2 back into the ride deck. Good guard. You already know my OT's out, so there's no way that could work. Oh, hey, that'll be for next turn. Okay, and finally, Emlyn's gonna go for 100 million with three critical. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh man, if I had hit another critical there, holy crap. Yeah, that'd have been, uh, that'd have been bad. All right, give me something good, deck. Come on give now. Give me a heal. Or a draw something. Oh, that's bad. Okay. <laughs> and once again, technically I was at the end of the battle. I was supposed to ride back to MLB again. That's how that works, but it's inconsequential in this case. Okay. Three. I'll pass over. Draw of turn. Uh, yeah. That'd be good. All right. So let's go ahead and energy blast seven. No persona right. ride. Yeah, you would think after drawing all those cards, I would draw Whoa. a persona ride, but Oh I my didn't. god, 20k base is going to be such a pain in the ass, though, now. Yeah. Let's go... It's like, yeah, Josh, I'm aware. Stop saying it. Oh. And, uh... Oh. No intercept thing. <laughs> that actually does suck. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. Uh, so you guys can read it a little bit more in case you're unaware of what this guy does, because this is about as much the star as Vargas himself is today. Yep, yep. Call. Ten. Alrighty. This seems about right. Uh, let's go for 23k on the Vanguard. I am going to garb with Biscotti, activating skill to energy blast 3, and draw Uno Cardo. That puts me up to 25. Alright. Drop this, draw a card. <laughs> Interesting. Alright, so we'll go ahead and swing with the boost, counter blast 1, gain 10k, retire him in. Retire this, draw a card. No, it's when it's something in the same uh, column is retired, and he fulfilled the condition when he used Boulder Axe skill. Oh, okay, sure. Yeah, you knew that. Smile. That's just, uh, same difference in this yeah, instance. Yeah, same, same difference, right? Again, it's similar to the MLB thing I just did. Technically, I was supposed to rewrite it a little bit earlier before the M1 attack, but it doesn't affect game state this time around. 38k. Hmm... Ooh, there's one of two ways I can go about it. I can try to go for a no CB turn here, and then just do that, or I could, uh, no, I'll give you your divine skill. Sure. First check, and second check. Draw trigger. Draw trigger, power to vanguard, draw card. Damage check. A critical trigger. I'm now at 30k base with triple critical. Soul blast one, retire. Draw a card. We stand. 
33. Hmm. Should I take this here, or would it be better? Let's see. How much CB would I need in the next turn? Two would be ideal. I don't have a means of counter charging. Hmm. This is tough. Because I could also hit another defensive, and that would just be a real pain in the ass for you at that point. I'll take it. Okay, no defensive. Mm, counter plus one, divine skill activates. Restand, drive plus two. 33 with pen drive. Two to pass. First check, draw trigger, power to vanguard. Uh oh. Draw card. Uh oh, see, you're gonna nail me here. Second check, critical ah, trigger, all fix vanguard. Damn, I should have, I should have played a little bit differently. Oh well. Well, a short fight night, but it's the one everyone, everyone wanted Vargas to win, and they got it. Their wish. <laughs> that was a, uh, that was a highly aggressive game. Indeed, uh, I should have guarded more correctly. Let's see, did you have PGs? You did not. You had some shield though. Hmm. Okay. Uh I was running pretty low on PGs the whole game. I was like, mm. right. Unfortunately, yeah, it's unfortunate because I had two PGs in my hands. But I, uh, I told myself he wouldn't, he wouldn't sack the double crit. I mean, not the double crit, the uh, the double trigger. But it happens. The I had two was... blaster blades in the hand for the following turn as well. Because that's why I was trying to ramp up CB was to try and go for maximum multi attack there. It's not quite as effective. Um, let's see. If I had opted to. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I could have definitely lived to that turn. I just misplayed. Damn. Oh, well. Yeah, I mean, you had two PGs, so <laughs> I don't think you had to fear at all. Yeah, uh, that was totally down in the misplay. Not the best fight night, but it is as it is. Well, fellas, if you did like this game, um, go ahead and uh, you know, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. We might do more rounds of this just because this is a pretty cool matchup. We may not. Maybe there's a little bit of a community need for it. So let us know if that's the case. Even if not, then we did enjoy this matchup, nothing else. So go ahead and check that out. And if you do want other kind of Vanguard content, well, you're in luck because I got loads of it. Tier lists, top tens, discussions, the whole shebang. So check those out as well if that's what you're fiending for. And if you like what you see, leave a subscribe and turn on notification bell for the next time I load a video. And with that, take care. God bless.